and welcome back to my challenge alien tax champion if you have not like and subscribe the channel please go to the google or youtube and search for the alien tax champion you will see here the alien tax champion if you click you will redirect it to my uh, website okay so you'll redirect it to the my youtube channel and uh, we ha i had this channel is regarding uh, anything related to the mobile device management especially for microsoft intune workspace one or mobile Aaron, okay or anything related to apple ios or android so you can see we have given the information so make sure you subscribe the channel and so that you will get the latest video okay so in this video i am going to show you how you can access the company portal wave company portal or how you can customize that and access both so uh, most of the pro right uh, when you configuring or setting up the company uh, microsoft tna for any customers uh, you need to be uh, very uh, conscious about branding for any organizations right like what what will be the uh, logo and other steps right how it look like what is the name of these right so these are the things how you can customize so that as soon as user will open the company portal into company portal app or if they access the wave company portal through any um, web browser they can get the same um, user experience right so how you can do that <clears throat> so this is microsoft endpoint portal hope you already aware if you know of course you can learn it from my website my, my channel okay so as soon as you landed in this space you have to go to the device um, tenant administrations okay and here you see the customization right so here you see the the this default policy right this is the default policy default customization and this is default customizations that is applied it's mentioned here that is applied to all users and devices so no matter whether it's android ios windows or anything and it can be edited but not be deleted because this is default policy okay and you can even they have given microsoft is preview the customization on the company portal okay so we'll edit this since i have already created so we'll edit this and we'll preview it i will show you okay so let's edit the setting so uh, what you want to configure you want to configure here like any organizations like i am configuring alien tag champion okay this organization name you can give it the color right or uh, color you you want to give it of course you you can give it right uh mm, you can uh, if you have the standard color if you want to define any 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 uh theme color as per your organization you can give it right you need you need to know the color code right you will get it from your ux team right and what you want to show in header like company logo and name or just logo only or name only so whatever so you can select it i am selecting logo and name okay and you want to upload the logo logo should be in greater than 72 px pixels right and maximum file size is 750 kb and it should be in png or jpg or jpg okay you can upload the logo uh, since i have already uploaded you can upload any other logo and same for the brand image logo for white and light background you can give the contact information right i have given already you can give it anything uh, as per the company information so here the configurations customize the setup experience in company portal for android and ios devices if you want to learn more you can of course click it and it will open which is actually very good how you can customize right so you see that available with prompt here let's go to so device enrollment and this is only for the android and ios so available you want to uh, available with prompt or without prompt with no prompt i say with prompt okay it should be with prompt 
privacy uh, but you can select it and you know the difference here what is this means available this default experience with prompt to enroll the all possible locations no prompt user can enroll via status in the device detail for the current devices for or the app unavailable there is no way to users to enroll app required enrollment will be hidden so it should be with prompt you can give the your company url uh, privacy url uh, privacy a message you want to give it you can customize the image app source everything right you want to show these applications you can hide it i will show you what is the difference so uh, and click on save it okay just save it that, that is very simple you can customize quickly and we'll preview this as soon as you save it it will take few minutes just click on preview it will open the intune um, uh, wave site similar like if you have uh, devices in role you can launch and you see i have given the alien tag champion a logo is there i have selected blue color right uh, and it's so and and you see some of the applications right so i will show you if uh, i will just change the color or name in fact and we'll remove these applications as well so how you can do this just go to the settings quickly and then we'll give it this open it okay anything i will change the color name uh, okay i will change the color to black okay let it be black and then and then we, we want to disable the applications right so these are the azure ad applications so you want to hide this you want to office online application we want to hide it i will hide both okay and click save it and we'll preview again or just refresh the idea. see right earlier it was showing blue now it's showing and it, it has also renamed it right and you see some of these applications it will get removed and i don't have any devices you will see similar like you can see <coughs> you have help text information here which, which is actually there right uh, these right uh, and then you you want to also uh, define the policies so let it be you you, you can just any time you can modify it, but you will not be able to delete this is the help text information side uh, and uh, as already applications let it be so okay so it's better to hide this application but if you have the azure application you want to open that you can so you want to open you want to uh, so these are all are information you can adjust it as per your requirement and you can also uh, assign the customization policy right to the organization and this policy when you assign it will override the default policy right so this is the default policy you see and you can override of course you can create this new policy so that this default policy will get applied right will not get applied to and you can create maximum of 10 policy for the customizations like you want to create a separate policy for ios or windows or mac os you can do this so the default policy uh, will not take uh, i mean your custom policy will take uh, precedence right this is very good uh, you should uh, actually learn about that and which is actually very nice for uh, all of you being as an admin you see i just change it to red and it should say red yeah it's very nice actually and similar like you, you can do uh, on your company portal app as well on ios or android devices i hope you have learned how you can customize these applications please uh, like this channel and subscribe so that you will get to know all those interesting video about how you can learn the microsoft intune till then thank you have a good day bye bye